Usime is a player award on Bobby Jennings, recently being named the Calf Player of the Year and is gaining attention from big football clubs. However, for the last two months, Usime has seen a massive decline in form, losing respect from Nigerian legends who else held him at a high regard. So what truly lost Usime's respect and why are Nigerian fans turning their back against him now? Usime's early life was filled with struggle. Growing up in Ojota, he was obligated to sell pure water and bread in the street of Lagos to earn a living for his family. He knew the only way to make it out of the slums was football. And after years of training and hard work, he was called up to the Nigerian Under-70 World Cup squad in 2015. This would eventually change his life forever, because during the Under-70 World Cup, Victor Usime bad goals against huge countries like United States, Chile, Croatia, Australia, Brazil, and Mali. He literally scored in every single tournament game. This made him the winner of the Golden Boot and Silver Ball, which gained him a lot of scouts' attention. And just a year later, he signed for the Bundesliga side Wolfsburg and has since gone on to achieve more than any Nigerian player could ever imagine. Given how far his humility has brought him, his recent actions has been that of a surprise package to all. On the 12th of June 2024, Osimel went live on Instagram. This simple action of his will cost him his respect among certain Nigerian football fans. During this rant, Osimel criticized the then Super Eagles coach, Fenerbahce George. This shocked Nigerian football fans, which made them beg the question, what was the reason for the rant and why did it bring such a private moment on life? But the answer soon presented itself to everyone after a deep dive into the situation. It all happened after Nigeria lost two games in the World Cup qualifier against Mali and Benin Republic. In these two games, Usme wasn't present due to an injury he sustained on club duties. During the Beningi press conference, Nigerian coach Fenerik George was asked why Usme hasn't played in the last two games and the comments he made was the cause of Usme's outposts. When giving his comments, the Nigerian coach didn't hold back, blaming Usime for the defeat to Benin Republic and also saying, unquote, he can beg Usime to play. But his criticism got a response from Usime, who denied the allegations made against him, claiming that he recorded evidence of him telling Fenedi George about the injury because he knew that would be used against him. He went on to end the life by saying he lost all respect for the man. Now, after two bad games, Everyone is blaming me. This life immediately went viral after the outburst, with fans and Nigerian football legends having mixed opinions about the situation. One fan wrote, Pride can show itself as lack of respect for authority. Pride proceeds downfall, a word for the wise, criticizing Usimin with her comment. Last year, Usimin, you are worshipped. Suddenly, now he has become a bad person because he chose to speak up for himself, siding with Osime with a comment. Ex-Nigerian youth league coach didn't hold back either, stating or quote, he is very rude and going public to rant that Ogo, which is the god of thunder in Yoruba in Nigerian language, will kill somebody, shows he was not brought up well. He also lacks good advisors to put him on track. Whether Osime goes down or not, all I know is that the coach finished the judge was to be blamed for making such a huge lie on television. Usime also wasn't supposed to make a response on Instagram, knowing the generation. All this means nothing now, as Usime is close to finalizing the deal with French giant PSG, making it all good and fine once again.